Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jaya, but you can call me Holly J. And if you're new here, thank you for stopping by. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. Anything you gotta do to get your life, okay? Um, so today, as you can tell by the title, I am prepping for my trip to Tulum, okay? Um, and the first stop is body contouring mentioned that i was interested in trying this like early on this year in one of my videos i think it was like my workout video um because i want to see like because i have like stubborn fat and like when i work out i definitely see what i want to see and i have been working out these past like three weeks i've been like really trying to make sure that i'm in the gym and so i just feel like uh, could be like that little help of like definition and like those little areas where trouble areas where like if I eat some bread it's back type of thing you know what I'm saying so I'm excited um my appointment is at 11 30 it's 11 25 I've been here for a few minutes but I couldn't figure out what door it was um and I have to get this last bottle down because um I couldn't eat an hour before and then I needed to take I needed to drink a liter of water which is two water bottles so I'm gonna finish this and then we're going to head inside and I hope they let me um vlog and everything because I'd like for whoever to kind of like put y'all on and tell you the benefits and everything like that but we just gonna um finish this water first and then We'll see what happens. We'll see. That was a really good experience it's actually not that long of a thing um i mean you sit under the little laser thing for i feel like it was like 30 minutes i would say it was like 30 minutes but y'all i was in there and you know gravity right 
you know that thing gravity right so you know how i told you i had to drink uh a liter of water before I got there and a liter of water is two bottles so you know I ch I, I got the first one in like you know you know sipping put sip the last one I was like all right we got to get this down you know what I'm saying sometimes when you have too much water so like, I don't want no more water so I had to get that one down you know I was good I should have peed first y'all because I was on that table in gravity oh so you just laying down right and she done already you know pushed on the stomach and then now you sitting there with the laser things on and y'all i had to pee so bad so bad <laughs> i had to pee so bad i was like sis how long i got because baby i gotta pee i held it out though she said you got four minutes i was like oh okay i did fine then because i really was like i feel like bro like if I pee, that's going to mess up the process. Like, she can't take this stuff off me. So, I'm just like, Jay, you got to hold it. You got to hold it. You got to hold it. Four minutes left, baby. I could not hold it no more. I was like, I cannot pee on this lady's table. <laughs> Super nice. Her name is Kayla, black girl. I didn't know that. So, that is a plus. Yeah, she, was, she just said, like, I have a really nice body type for this. Um... And she was like, please come back because we can, like, shape you. We can get you. We. She's like, I would like to, like, you know, curve out the shape next time. Drink a lot of water today, no alcohol, and eat light. So, and then she said, like, over the next course of days, um, the way that the thingy works or whatever, it breaks down the fat to liquefy it. So, I need to keep flu like fluid in me so that I flush out all the fat. And then she said, even like the next couple days, you're like what you saw today is gonna look like ten times better. I say, I'm gonna try to come back in next week and before my trip, cause she was like, yes, yeah, like really, if you do a second session, she's like, really, you just need three. But she was like your trip if you come and then she's just like her special ends on the 30th so she said go ahead and book under the special and they could be in december so i was like oh, okay 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 that makes sense so i'll still get it for 60 or whatever the, whatever i'll still get it for the deal is what i'm trying to say anyways um next is we're gonna go finish running some errands i need to eat because i'm hungry so i'm thinking to get a salad from chick-fil-a Mm-hmm. And then I wrote a list of the things that I need for my trip. Just stuff like that. Like that's what we doing. We run around, we getting stuff done. I need contacts. I need to go check on that. Like we getting stuff done. Okay. Who's calling? Oh, it was just my boyfriend. <laughs> okay, so I'm trying to find a chick fil A. Cause I need something to eat. Oh, I'm supposed to be calling them damn people. All right, let me call them people. Hey, I just got done talking to them, y'all. I swear, I'm not coming back to this location ever again because it's like slow. Like they're just kind of slow. Like all she can tell me is, I can't really find your chart right now, and I have someone in front of you. So can we like do this in 15 minutes? No, I was here two and a half weeks ago. No, I didn't get no phone call. No. Hello. Next to this, like, Ross. And this seems like a very um Hispanic area. And normally, and y'all, I'm not being prejudiced or anything, okay? But in Tampa, like, I'll, and I'll just say for my city. In Tampa, wherever, like, the Spanish people are, those Rosses be the one they got a lot of stuff in here just like i thought <laughs> Yeah.
day honestly and I feel like nah I got stuff done um I did but I need to eat some food like she told me like to be drinking water I don't have no water like I'm not even following directions so that's how like I just feel like I've been so busy but I really just been getting like a lot of phone calls today because we're just finalizing like trip details so yeah so i'm just gonna eat my salad i hope i got the right kind yeah i did so i got the cob salad from chick-fil-a took off the cheese i don't like cheese in my salad i don't but i took the cheese off and the bacon off because we don't do swine over here, baby. At all. Get a little pepperoni here and there. A little and do yay sausage in my jump in my gum battle. But that's about it. Pork really made my stomach hurt, to be honest. And I think that's just because like I never ate it. So when I eat it, it made my stomach hurt. Oh my gosh, first time eating today. Oh my goodness. And I'm trying to be on some healthy girls. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just going to eat my salad. And then I believe my next stop will be Target. It feels so freaking late. Like I need to be heading home. But it's 4.15. Like this daylight savings. Amen. Please let this bus make some ranch, but for now. Mm. That's a good ranch.
Okay, y'all. So it's much later, like 12:30 later, because I didn't mean to leave y'all hanging like that. But I was in Target, and my cousin called me. I mean, actually, we I talked to her earlier today, and then I was in Target, and she texted me and was like, "I'm pulling up," and I'm like, "Wait, what? Where?" So basically, I just was unaware that like my cousins was coming over to kind of hang out with us for the day. Um, and well, not even the day, more like the evening. And they came and like ate some food and stuff. We had some dessert, we played car games. Like we enjoyed each other's company. So I was like, it was unexpected, but obviously that's what I was doing. But I had all intentions to come home and show y'all what I got from Target to prepare for my trip or at least get started or just today in general i want to show you what i ended up getting okay so i got a travel little kit thing um y'all i don't know why i went to target why did i go to target i know why i went to target but it just was not a smart idea <laughs> i hope my bonnet don't be moving around like um was it young jock or was it ray j when his hat kept moving I'm just trying to make my bonnet look some kind of cute. Like, what the heck? What's it giving? Okay, we'll do that. But yeah, I got this little TSA compliant travel container kit. I mean, you know, the standard regular degular. Most of the stuff that I got was from like the little dollar little aisle with like the mini travel size stuff. Um, but I definitely wanted to get one of these because I like how you get the pouch too. And I be needing like pouches for like makeup and you know just sticking stuff and stuff. Comes to this, I got this too because it's it's honestly Target and it's just really cute and it says beautiful, um, confident. No, it says beautiful, capable, and worthy. I just really love that like. Because, yes, I am. I found me a bathing suit in there. <sighs> didn't go in there for a bathing suit. But I didn't really get me any bathing suits for this trip either. Um, I wasn't too, like, pressed on getting new bathing suits. Because I don't think we'll be doing a lot of, like, just beach going. Like, we actually have plans. Or at least we have intentional plans. Um, so I wasn't really pressed about a bathing suit and i got these black bottoms i got them in a large eight and four like a size eight for ten i hope they fit um i wasn't able to like try them on but i did try them all over my clothes and y'all the way my behind is set up i need a large yes yeah, so like they're just black high waist high leg um swimsuit pant bottoms and i love that target is like getting into the different cut i got this leopard top to go with it you know nothing nothing too crazy but like just a little mix and match set i almost pick up a green neon one and it was so cute but you know target's not cheap so i had to just get me one set and I have a green swimsuit, so I was like, let me not do that again. So I got this um, spray bottle, just regular degla blue. I got this soap container. I got my, um, you know, handy dandy makeup removal wipes, the Neutrogena ones. It's the only ones that work for real. I got me a little um, suntan sun spray lotion. Yep. The sport kind. And then I got another one too. Because the other one said 70 proof. And I was like oh I need that. And it's water and sun. So this is the beach defense by Neutrogena. Picked this one up too. So this will probably go on my face. And like you know the tops of my shoulders. Like where the sun really hits. Um, I got me like a travel size contact solution i love using bio true i like bio true over opti free because um bio true doesn't trip about you using it as a like um 
what's it called as a eye drops i be free you like on the bottle it says do not put this directly in your eyes so so then i also got me a new um contour palette because mine is gone so just had to cop that um got these travel size garnier fructis conditioner and shampoo for my wig that i'm gonna be wearing hand sanitizer baby okay the purell i actually found purell like y'all purell the 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 hand sanitizer we grew up on that like actually smell like they actually are cleaning your hands have been nowhere to be found these days like and i got bug spray because um for one like yes like we're gonna be doing outside activities whatever the case may be but I watched Glamazante go to Tulum and the one thing she said is the mosquitoes, child. And then I just got a travel little deodorant. This is the spray kind. I've been wanting to try spray deodorant for a minute. I'm not necessarily the Dove. I wanted to try Secret. But just for the sake of this, I went and got it. And then from Ross, I got, I really just got this. Oh no, I got a few things. But I got this little, um touch pad little mirror mini mirror i was like let me get this this is by impressions vanity by the way um and it's rose gold and cute and it's like rechargeable it has three um light color temperatures cool light natural light warm light i can already see all my friends fighting me for this mirror but baby it's mine because <laughs> when you go on trips like y'all be fighting for the mirror so i was like i need a mirror um and then i got this from Ross too so this is like it's like a what does Olivia call it dang I forgot what she called it but it's just like you know it gives dashiki vibes but it's like a full-blown dress and I was just like, this is so Tulum. And like, whenever maybe I just get fresh out of the shower. You know, you don't really want clothes on you. Like, you don't really want stuff on you. Like, this is going to let me breathe so much. I just put some drawers on or no drawers and call it a day. This 32-inch um, duffel bag, it's not the cutest. Okay? This isn't necessarily my style style i kind of went with the cutest one and honestly if i really thought about it a little bit more i probably would have just got the one that looks like a camo one and called it a day instead of these little flowers but i don't know we're not gonna worry about that part but i just got this bag it's pretty big so it like it's pretty big so really and truly <laughs> It's deciding whether or not I'm gonna do my nails. And honestly, honestly, it's probably a good idea. It's probably a good idea, but I have to freaking go to the nail salon. I hate the nail salon. At the very least, y'all, the next step is to get my toes done. Like, at the very least, I need my toes done. I need to buy some lashes. If I'm not going to get my lashes done, I need some lashes. I need some memory cards because I'm going to be vlogging and taking pictures. And I don't need, and I can't be worried about, okay, I need to take this stuff off my memory card, put it on my computer. Like, no. Mm -mm. So I need memory cards, but I'm going to get that on Cyber Monday if I can on Amazon. And. That's pretty much it. Like, me not getting my hair done changed the whole game. Like, I'm just going to wear my wig. Because at the end of the day, it's like, who am I trying to, like, yes, you want to look good for yourself and whatnot, but who am I trying to impress? If you still listening to me, I love you, okay? But I'm going to let you go now.